Well, the race for Philadelphia mayor is now taking shape. The former Democratic City Councilman Jim Kenney made it official today as he threw his hat in the ring. Our Pat Chiraki was there at City Hall, and she's live with what it means in this Democratic primary. Pat? Well, uh, Chris, now we have four official candidates on the Democratic side. The Democratic primary 104 days away on May the 19th. With Councilman Kenny's entrance into the race for mayor, it changes the dynamic of the race for City Hall. Jim Kenny came to the mayor's reception room at City Hall, standing at what he hopes will ultimately be the goal line. I want to eliminate the Philly shrug from our vocabulary and want to be the can-do city that we all know we are. The and former six-term councilman at large, with deep roots in South Philly and with labor, found District 1199C setting the tone with he gets it in big letters. Every child in this city is all of our children. Not someone else's children, not some other neighborhood's children, not their children, our children. The 56-year-old Kenny enters the campaign next to political veterans, former DA Lynn Abraham, state senator Anthony Williams, and former judge and city solicitor Nelson Diaz. It certainly changes the demographic profile uh, of the primary. Drexel University political science professor Richard Dilworth sees each candidate with a voter base that may make them more cautious on flinty issues. You've got one uh, sort of front runner African American candidate, you have a, a white woman, a Latino candidate, uh, and now you have a white man candidate. With the exception of Lynn Abraham, I think, I don't think that any of them. Uh, have had a position uh, where they'd face the kind of challenges that, that they would face uh, when they're mayor. Given the profile of the candidates, I don't think any of them have really been pushed to take any strong positions. Well, and Dilworth believes there are two crucial issues to be considered, education funding as well as economic development for the city. Coming on Saturday, we are expecting that there will be a fifth candidate who will announce his position, and that would be former mayoral new secretary Doug Oliver. Reporting live from City Hall, Pat Shiraki, CBS3 Eyewitness News.